start by just telling us your name, who you are, and what you do. Hello everyone, I'm Claudia Hashray, girl with no job, influencer by day, and influencer by night also. So tell us about how you became an influencer, or what the name of your brand is, and how you started it. My brand is Girl With No Job. I became an influencer totally by accident. I didn't even know what an influencer was up until like a month ago. I still don't know what it is, because I don't have a lot of influence. I'm just kidding. Um, I started when I was a freshman at NYU. I just started a blog. Isn't that how everyone becomes an influencer? They just start a blog. What was your blog about? It was called Girl With A Jar, and I had this terrible internship that was miserable, unpaid, everyone hated me, I was a bad intern. On my blog. And so what's the name of your brand now and how do people know you on the web? So I'm Girl With No Job now. I changed it when I got fired from that internship just for accuracy purposes. Um, and everyone knows me by Girl With No Job because my Instagram has um, 2 million followers. How do you think you were able to successfully build up your following? Um, relatability has just been huge for me because my uh, platform grows with comments. So anytime I can put up a picture that resonates with someone and it resonates so much they just want to tag their friends, that's how I get I expand my network. Rel relatability. And you were recently on Watch What Happens Live. I was. How did you pull that off and what did you do? I started a change.org petition. People say change.org has never accomplished anything, but I am a I'm proof that it does. I started a petition, I wanted to be the bartender, I got all my followers to sign it, and within a week it was on Andy Cohen's desk. Wow, and so then he called you up and asked you to come on the show? Basically. He didn't call me per se, someone who worked there did, but I tell everyone that Andy called me, so. And have you worked with brands or advertisers at all yet? Yes. Um, the number one way that I've started to monetize my social following is uh, brand partnerships and um, endorsements. So basically brands come to me, they want to get in with like the cool young hip kids on Instagram and I provide those. And um, we make a native piece of content that lives on my Instagram. It's both funny and it's similar to something I would normally post, but it's also pushing whatever campaign or product the brand is trying to sell. And what are some examples of advertisers you've worked with already? Yeah. Who have you worked with already? Oh, uh, Captain Morgan, Netflix, Hulu, um, E Network, uh, VH1 Network, basically all the cool young brands. What advice do you have for advertisers who might want to work with you? How should they approach you? If you're going to approach the influencer space, understand how it works. Don't try and partner with an influencer and then make up all your own rules. You have to understand how the influencer network and the influencer space works, and then you'll make great content with great engagement and great conversions. But if you just walk in there with your own priorities, no one's going to want to work with you. Great. Thank you very much. Thank you.